All right, so this is a rerun of our winners' finals. We got a game five set earlier. These guys play in grands all the time here in Michigan, so should be a good one. Head into Tower of Heaven. And so this would be their typical picks. Um, they're pretty well versed in this matchup by this point. Dakota in some immediate disadvantage, but bringing it back around here. Scooter is pretty well known for his cape. You'll see that he's hit it about five times this stock already, and that's his go-to for finishing. He'll cover the bottom of the stage and start up being all over the place. Dakota trying to take this stock back to even. It's looking pretty good. What, you don't like me saying Dakota? What's that? <laughs> okay. Gucci giving me a face, but he's not even giving me a face. Alright, staying nice and even here. Which is kind of what we expect from these two. Oh! The quick down air. That, that nice 69%. Dakota trying to get him out before he gets too much extra credit, and we are back on even stocks here. Let's see who's going to close this game out. Scooter's got Combust charged up. He's not one for using Combust too often. He often uses Clone, but he gets it there. Not quite going to kill. Kind of surprising, Orion being as light as he is, you'd think that might take him off. But the up smash, and it is on the game too. DK on the color choice mix-up. Scooter comes right out the gate with decent string, not letting DK get in just yet, but just like that, DK is back in advantage, gonna get some nice percent in on the ledge guard, and he's out. Ori's very lethal, with just a couple back airs, you can be at 40% and suddenly you're gone. DK has some really good sign coverage. He'll try to frame trap you, uh, make sure he covers both of your options. If you're about to roll, he'll try to get one side and then cover the other. But it looks like we are coming on the final stock for Scooter. DK pretty far ahead this match. Scooter bringing it back here. It only takes really one good hit and he's out. Ori being as light as he is, it's coming up on the point where Scooter has one nice hit to get him out. There it is! Some nice guarding on this ledge. Gonna try to not let DK get back in the game. So far we've had some uh, pretty big turnarounds here. Oh! And there, there goes Scooter. I think he probably could have gotten back. I'm not sure if that was a missed input. One back air, one smash, DK's out of here. So he really needs to 
play top of his game to just get this match here. Good tech. Lots of rolls. Oh, and there he goes. I think that was unfortunately two SDs in that game. Can't be, be feeling too great on that, but it's one and one. At this point, now we're just playing a good old fashioned best of three to finish it up. Going to Air Armada, not everybody's favorite stage. Easy for uh, DK to get pineappled here. Scooter once again coming out of the gate with some solid aggression, some good hits. That parry thought could have been it, but... Dakota doing a good job of clearing up some smoke just while comboing. You really need to know where your opponent is, so uh, he's just trying to give himself a little bit more vision. And the back air swing. Oh, and the bash attempt. That was risky, and it did not pan out for DK there. If he had hit it, it was a guaranteed kill. But it's basically you kill or you die. But he cleans up the stock anyway, and they're pretty much on even footing. Dare might spike that could have put DK in some good disadvantage, but good guess on that uh, positioning. Scooter doing his best to use that smoke to his disadvantage or to his advantage, but it's not tricking up DK in this game. Good parry. It's gonna just get him off stage. Get some three percent in. Great recovery from DK. But here comes Scooter to take the stock. Alright, and these guys have a, a great trend of getting really far ahead and then just running up right back to pretty even footing. They really are just very close on, mm, to being on the exact same level. They end up in grands all the time and it does go back and forth between the two of them. It's been really contentious deciding uh, PR picks before between the two of them just because they have such similar records. And it comes down to a head-to-head. -head. DK does win a little bit more often and that ends up uh, giving him a bit of an advantage. but. Anyone watching would see that it's very close. Smoke doing a good job to help with the recovery. There's not much DK can do there to cover it, but he does clean up the stock and the game. It is one point for DK to win. Scooter has to get two wins in a row here to take it for himself. Some quick, easy bans. DK tends to know where he wants to ban. And on to Smashville. Some quick back and forth. These two players do tend to just get in some nice strings every time they win advantage. It's so you just get a quick lead, the other person grabs advantage, gets right back even with them, maybe gets a little bit further, and then it's back and forth, back and forth. But we are coming up on the end of the first stocks here for both of them. And there it goes, UK. Let's see if he can get it back. Like that. Good parry, gets two smoke charges out. Sometimes hard to tell what Forsborn is doing with the recovery. It looked like he had died. It sounded like he had died, but just pop right back up there.
cleans up the stock. Not too much extra credit for a scooter. But he's going to change that right now. DK trying to get the follow up on that down air, but scooter DIing correctly to get out of the way. And that stock. Scooter up almost an entire stock here, looking like he's having a good game. And just as predicted, we might just have a repeat of that five game finals match. Tech. Lots of down airs coming from Scooter. Good cape coverage. Oh, and a missed bash that was risky, but he pulled it back. Good tech. And the bash to clean it up. DK has to have a pretty good stock here to win this one. Oh, that was very close, but and the, the down smash will clean it up. We are on game five. DK did win in finals here, so Scooter is looking for a good chance to, uh, to redeem himself, but if he does, we do get the bracket set reset. DK hovering treetop lodge again, just like he did last time. He really does think a lot about his stage choices. He has a good idea of what benefits him, what might hurt him. And here we are on the forest floor for game five of our grand finals. Will DK take it home? Will Scooter get the bracket reset? Scooter really doing a good job in every single game of just coming out with some solid aggression, getting some good percent on. Every game, DK starts off trying to bring it back. Ooh, and the unfortunate SD, DK looking at his controller, wondering what it has, why it has betrayed him. SDDK is still looking pretty good in this game. And he cleans it up, not looking too much worse for the wear. Getting some good guesses on that Forsburn location. up a little early. That was probably about as early as that up smash was going to kill. Um, but right on time, Scooter gets it. So DK does have a little bit of climb to do to get out of this hole. back and kill percent, so he is going to have to do his very best to uh, pull this back. We're just not cleaning up the stock here. Oh, but we do have another SD for this match. I think that's we're coming on four or five here. See if that is going to be what DK needed, and unfortunately with that parry, unfortunately in Scooter's case, we have a uh, Wrapped it up, reset bracket, and we...